So, it's me or little boy, Kiss Samson. I have this word to give us. They accurately, truly know that you are going to be wealthy. Believe me. They know that your blood carry the blood of what? Of wealthy. When I mean your blood lineage, they know that you are going to be wealthy. But they will never tell you. You know, the truth is this. There are some people who will see you today and said, ah, <laughs> where you are going to be is something what is something unbelievable. Many, many people will never tell you that this is what they see. This is what they have been told about you. Because they don't want you to figure out whom you are. Yes, listen, I say choosing. You may be struggling now. Life may be so hard, difficult, but I'm here to tell you that doesn't, that is not the final say. <laughs> because even your mom, your dad may be hitting that word, that, that, that calling, that calling on you, that calling, that purpose, that dream, they may be hitting it from you. They will not tell you because many of them never believe that you have such greater word impact you have that greater purpose in you that is why the moment joseph was revealed the moment it was revealed to joseph that this is whom you you are going to be this is whom you are called to be and your brothers and your sisters will be under you <laughs> your brothers will be under you the moment he, 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 he released that word many of them become what nervous many of them become mad many of them become angry at him so, but the truth is this Sometimes our people around us, our neighbors, our cousins, they know accurately that we are called for greatness. They know that there's something different and there's something big in us. But they are not going to tell us why, because they're envy of our doing. They know that in time to come, yes, you may be struggling today. <laughs> you that is watching me, you may be looking at if life is not giving you what to want. Things are hard around you. Things are not okay. Yes, you cry day and night. You ask God for, for intervention. But you are working hard. But believe me, a day is coming that those who mock you today, <laughs> many of them will be surprised and say, you are using what? You are using medicine. You are using the destiny. Imagine lazy people. You know, that's what I, you know, there's something I figured out early, early last week that most lazy people are mostly those who will tell you that they don't work hard they are working smart <laughs> but the moment they see you who is working hard the moment they see the reproductive of your doing the the, the outcome of your hard work they will start to envy you but there there are the same people who said they don't work hard they work smart <laughs> so what i'm trying to say is this so the truth is this Many people know that you are going to be great. Many people know that you carry that calling of worthy. When I mean worthy, you are going to be worthy. You are going to be great to a point where men who are honored are going to call you honor. Where men who are known are going to do what are going to honor you. They know it, but they will never tell you because many of them are shocked. Many of them are mad. Many of them are frustrated. You come saying many of them it hurt them because they can't believe that such greater grace, such power, such authority lies in you because they never believe it. That is why they will suddenly become angry, mad at you the moment they do it, the moment anytime they see you. That's why sometimes you may have everything in you. You, they may have everything within them, but yet they will still be envy of the little one you have. You know, do you know that as I'm just passing by like this, someone I can, you know, if mostly those who have evil spirit, evil spiritual eyes, they can just see you on the street. They'll just say, you know, like the way that one of the things that they tell one of my, my boss, you know, when he was in the village, he said he was just coming back from farm, you know, like this as I was just going, you know, coming back. So one native daughter called him and he said to him, you don't greet anyone, you don't respect anyone because in time to come now, you will not be in, in, in Nigeria. In time to come, you will not even drive machine or all this thing. You will be driving car, you will be so rich. And my, and my, my brother, my, my boss now that he was telling all these things, he don't even have machine. He was just driving what? Bicycle. And this man was reviewing everything to him. And he becomes shocked. But right now, where the guy is, there is a proof that the prophecy that the native daughter gives to him is working. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So some people will just see you 
Maybe you have never met. They will just see you. That's why sometimes you will meet a stranger. The next thing they become angry. They become mad because the moment they see you, they see something that is inside you. It's just like when you when you see a sunbird, you you read the sunbird. This is how they see you accurately. The moment they see you, they know that this is whom you are called for. This is what lies in you. This is the greatness in you. This is the power of God in you. And that no that do that make them become what nervous, and that make them become angry because many of them never thought that you can have such greater grace many of them never believe that that power can still be in you that you have that calling despite of you that you are struggling believe me <laughs> despite that you are struggling despite that things are hard a little bit but yet they'll still be annoyed mad because many of them really understand that there's something in you that they themselves cannot compete with you know what i'm saying so remember bless me god bless you and if you have not subscribed to my channel, please kindly subscribe and thumbs up for the bell.